bubbly water bottle. Here's a hydroxy for gas toolbox. Easy to be portable. One side's got two bottles that you replace quite often. Two bubbling water bottles. That's around three and a half amps. Here's what's inside. This is the controller box. There's the ants, bolts, 33 hertz, 56 duty cycle. That's stuff in the cell, one and a half quart tank, Big large capacitor, four roids. You can turn the fan on, and the pump. I have two switches, one for the pump, one for the fan, you can turn them on off. You only need the fan if it's if it's off. The amps went up a little bit because I have the pump on. The tank only needs to be halfway filled, this is the water very quickly. And the lid shuts sorta. Good for carrying, but I'd, I'd leave it open while using it. That's about it. Thanks. up a little bit because I have the pump on. The tank only needs to be halfway filled because of the water very quickly. And the lid shuts sort of. It's good for carrying but I'd, I'd leave it open while using it. That's about it. Thanks. turns on. Beer capac can capacitor goes up to 15.8 volts and you can turn it on pushing that button. Got 33 hertz, 56% duty cycle, which gives us here's a PWM reading. Got three 2.9 volts. And you turn this pump on. pump and there's the pump and filter you could clean out uh, every six months. There's some filter element in there. 12 volt pump. Ten dollars to replace it if it ever goes out. They, they, they keep on going. And we put a pump on there because the water level can only, only, only has to be this high. Uh, here's the two this is our RF choke stops the pulsing anti-toroid and here's your Inductor toroid. This brings in the non Hertzian energy, negative uh, spikes, which makes the gas more negative charge. Plus, being a sealed cell, or two bolts in the plates. This is just a spin, plum, preliminary setup. Um, Has a fan on here in case it gets hot. This comes off as well, so you can move this around. Um, you can turn the fan on. This 
switch here, slide switch. Make it a fan. And also there's a pump switch, you can turn the pump off. You really don't need it on. In the morning you can turn it on. I mean, it still bubbles. Turn the fan on. You can turn the pump on, what it does is it recirculates all the water through all the plates so you get more surface area. It does bubble a little bit more, but it's really not needed. If you don't want to hear the noise, you can turn it off. The fan's kind of noisy, but after a while it gets hot. I would leave it off while you're, until it gets warm. The beer can capacitor, the light turns off once after a minute. And uh, when you first turn it on, it stops bubbling. When you first turn it on, if it doesn't bubble within 10 seconds, turn it off. That means you got a clog somewhere. Like in, I have a one way check valve, but it just goes to the bubbler, it goes to the box. And uh, I'm going to put on. Uh, I have this all apart to show you how it all fits together. It, it can be all taken apart. Everything's replaceable and fixable. This is the pump down here and the filter. He changes every six months. It's white poly filter you get at the hardware store. Any of that. You just cut pieces to fit in there. The pump's ten dollars to replace it. And, and, uh, Here's a Grachy. The breathing machine. That's how it works. And this button turn on. And that turns on. Beer fast can capacitor goes up to 3.8 volts. And you can turn it on. Push that button. 33 hertz. 56% duty cycle. Which gives us here's a NBM reading. Three two point nine volts. And turn the pump on. There's the pump and filter you can clean out uh, every six months. There's a filter element in there. Twelve volt pump. Ten dollars to replace it if it ever goes out. They, they, they keep on going. We put a pump on there because the water level can only, can only has to be this high. Uh, here's the two star. RF choke stops the pulsing anti toroid. And here's your conductor toroid. This brings in the non hertzian energy negative uh, spikes, which makes the gas more negative charge. Plus, being a sealed cell for two volt in place. This is the plumb plumb on every setup.